Hey Sweetwater, my name is OP, I'm from Serato, and today I have something really exciting to show you. With the release of Serato DJ Pro 3.0 and Serato DJ Lite 3.0, we have now introduced a new feature called Stems. With the new Stems feature, you can take your songs and do real-time audio separation, giving you the vocal, melody, bass, and drums with one click on the screen or with pads or parameters on your DJ controller or mixer. This is using Serato's one-of-a-kind machine learning algorithm, which allows the best sound quality and performance for real-time audio separation in the market. It's pretty amazing. Let me show you how it works specifically with Serato DJ Pro 3.0. Let's go. In Serato DJ Pro 3.0 and above, you can access stems by pressing the stems icon here. When it's open, you can have the pad layout that's similar to your cue points, but it's set up specifically for functions for audio separation. On the top row, you have buttons for vocals, melody, bass, and drum audio separation. When you press any of these buttons while you're playing a song that has the elements in it, that part of the song will be separated or muted. For this example here, if I press the vocal, it will be removed from the song just leaving the instrumental. To add it back in, I can press the vocal button again and the vocals will automatically return to the song. The same process goes for the three other musical parts in the song. Check out with the melody, bass, and drums removed individually. As you see, that's instant and so clean. Absolutely amazing. When you're using Serato DJ Pro, the second row of pads are for the effects for each one of those features. Please note that these are not available with Serato DJ Lite. The first pad is for the vocal echo. When it's pressed, the vocal will echo out with the song and the time of the beat. Let me show you real quick. The instrumental echo will echo out the instrument sounds at the same time. That's including the melody, the bass, and the drums, and it will just leave the vocal. And when you press it again, it will bring the instruments back into the track instantly. Let's check it out. The instrumental breaker will apply a DJ style breaker to the instrument sounds. That's the melody, the bass, and the drums all at the same time, just leaving the vocals. When you press it again, it'll bring back those instrumental sounds instantly. Check it out. The drum echo will echo out the drums, leaving just the vocals, melody, and bass. And when you press the button again, it'll bring the drums back in. Let's check it out. By using either row of buttons, you can get creative in having parts of your song in and out on the fly at your choosing. This is great for doing live edits and easy transitions between your stem tracks during your DJ set. Serato Stems will work with a wide variety of Serato DJ approved controllers and mixers that have pads. You can find the list of approved hardware on serato.com. For this example, I'm using the Pioneer DJ 
DDJ Rev7 controller. To access stems on the pads, you need to replace a pad mode on the hardware. Here in the preferences in the setup, you can choose between the sampler, slicer, or loop roll to replace the stems mode. I'm gonna replace the sampler for the stems. I'm in the hot cue mode now, but when I press sampler, this now allows me to turn the stems on and off as needed. And this can be done independently on each deck. You can also have four deck controls using stems, depending on the DJ hardware that you're using. When you're using stems, all the other Serato DJ Pro features work, such as hot cues, loops, rolls, effects, flips, pitch and time DJ, and much more. This creates the opportunity for some really exciting and unique DJ mixes. For example, let's do a simple mix here between these two songs. For this song, I'm gonna take out the bass and the drums, so only the vocals and the melody play. Check it out. Sit down, sister. It's not worth your time. And for the second song, I'm gonna take out the vocals and the melody, so only the drums and the bass play. Okay, so now I'm gonna put this together in a mix and you'll hear how it sounds. And just that easy, you can remix two songs in your library in real time with great audio quality. Now imagine what you can do. Your choices are almost limitless based on your creativity. When you're attached to hardware that has parameter buttons, you can use them to instantly get the vocals with no instrumental or the instrumental with no vocals with the press of the buttons. Sit down, it's not worth You can also do this in the program by pressing the mic and keyboard symbols here. There's also a stems prepare crate that you can use for files in your computer or external hard drive. When you load the songs into the crate, it will analyze the file and prepare the songs for audio separation. That way, when you load the track into your deck, the audio separation will happen without any delay. Some older computers may not have enough power to do the instant separation, so this is a workaround for that. You can use streaming songs inside of Serato DJ Pro from BeatSource and other streaming platforms to use stems for your DJ mixes. Unfortunately, you cannot record DJ mixes inside of Serato DJ Pro while using streaming tracks. But you can record DJ sets with files that are directly on your computer or your external hard drive that you use for your DJ sets. This means that if you want to record mixes where you utilize stems, you can do so.
MIDI map stems features to user modes on your controller or mixer, or you can map them to external MIDI devices. To learn how to do this MIDI mapping on a piece of hardware, check out the Serato support article in the description of this video. You can also use stems in the offline player mode or in Serato Play. This means that if you're just using your computer and not connected to any DJ hardware, you can access stems features. This is great for creating ideas where you're not in front of your mixer or controller, or you're on the move with just your laptop. Please note that in the offline player, you can only have the vocal or the instrumental features. You cannot choose the individual stem parts, nor can you choose the stem effects. But if you're in Serato Play, you can access all the features. Stems is recommended to work with newer Apple or Windows computers. You'll need to be on Mac OS Big Sur or Monterey to use Serato DJ Pro 3.0 with stems. Future Mac OSs will be supported. And if you're on Windows, you can use Windows 10 or 11 with Serato DJ Pro. Please note that legacy Rain hardware in particular will not work with Serato DJ Pro 3.0. This includes the Rain 57 MK2, the Rain 60 series of mixers, especially the 62 mixer, which is really popular, and also the SL series of boxes, the SL2, 3, and 4. But newer Rain gear like the 70, the 72, the 72 Mark II, and the RAIN 1 will work with Serato DJ Pro 3.0 and also stems. And also note that the Denon DS1 box will work with Serato DJ Pro 3.0 and stems. If you need to upgrade your gear, talk to your Sweetwater sales engineer and they'll give you some great advice and options for you to consider. Serato stems is here and this is a huge step forward in DJ technology. Stems will be available for free in Serato DJ Lite and also Serato DJ Pro if you have the license. That literally means when it comes out, you could update and you'll have it for free and you'll get busy. Have fun and get creative using stems. And make sure to contact your Sweetwater sales engineer to learn more about Serato DJ Pro 3.0 and also Serato stems. My name is OP, Artist Relations Manager for Serato, and I'll check you next time. Peace.